Uh, result. Of course, when you when you lose a game, you're disappointed. It's a it's a game that can go both ways. It's uh, as you expect away from home in in the Premier League. Mourinho said on Sky Sports he sees no improvement at all from last season to now. What do you think about that assessment? Well, I think he's got uh, right for to his opinion. Uh, of course, we uh, we lost here last year. It's always a Difficult ground to go to, and we hope we should um, do better than we did, and uh, we hope for better. So, uh, but the key moments they uh, grasped, we didn't. I have to say, two fantastic finishes from uh, two good left foots, left feet. Uh, sorry, and we just didn't take the chances when we had them. No, uh, we've got to scan him uh, tomorrow. He felt it gro he's growing, so he'll probably be out for a little while, but uh, I can update you later on when I know that. Well, you, you said you came into the season a striker light, and yeah. you ended up for half an hour without any sense forward. Yeah. forward. Yeah, it's How just... How that for you? How does that make your job? It's just one of these uh, <laughs> moments. Uh, some t we've had... Uh, Historically, loads of uh, centre-backs uh, over the last few years struggling with injuries. We've gone down here with uh, Michael Carrick's played centre-back. I don't know if he played here, but we've got Darren Fletcher. Not at the moment, it's strikers. That's just uh, how it's gone. Hopefully, Mason and Anthony will be uh, back for uh, definitely Arsenal. Or, uh, hopefully, one of them for uh, Rochdale. We uh, made a decision on that and uh, I still think it was uh, the best one for us and for Alexis and we agreed on that one. Oh, do, you think, do, do you think you did enough to open up for Sam today? Do you think there was enough pace and decision about the performance? No, we didn't create enough chances, uh, but we created big chances, some big moments that we didn't take and they scored on their... Uh, they didn't create too many either. It's a game that could have gone both ways and... Uh, when you got Rashford and Dan James, I don't think pace is the the problem. Oh, there's a few in the, in the first half that we uh, we turned down uh, a key pass, but of course the two chances we have second half are, are chances that we could uh, have again, and I'm sure we'll we'll score more than we miss. Well, you created more. You said they created more chances in the second half than you did the first. Yeah. What was your message to the team at half time? And they were out considerably earlier than West Ham. Did you send that out? Did you send them out early? Was that on purpose? No, it's a it's a good group to uh, work with. They're uh, determined. They're uh, this is not. Um, uh, sometimes along the road you're going to hit some uh, bumps, as we've said, some highs and lows. This group was out there determined. They had, they showed the desire. We want to get out. We, it was a good atmosphere in the dressing room, and um, they've got the uh, the focus right. Well, for me, I was right in front of me. I don't know how badly he caught him, so uh, the video uh, assistant probably had the right... Uh, but I thought it was quite a straight leg. OK, last question. Uh, sorry, uh, Ollie, were they doing what you wanted out there today in terms of preparation? Yeah, this group <laughs> is... Uh, they want to want to do what we're trying to do, we're working in training. Of course, this, as I said, there's key moments in games that can tip these games in our favour uh, compared to theirs. And you make a, may, maybe a bad decision on a pass, left, right, centre, but the attitude and desire is there. That's, that's not the problem. It's uh, the quality when we, uh, in our decision making and sometimes in the, how do you say, in the, in the quality, execution, that's the word, so, my Norwegian... Uh, English isn't the best at times. Okay, guys, thank you. All right.